Hello students, in this video we are going to <coughs> learn about the pelvis, the differences between male and female pelvis. It is very essential to know as the female pelvis is basically uh, adapted for the child uh, bearing and that is uh, for the parturition. So there are um, some differences which are very important and that you all have to know by <coughs> observing the pelvis so here is it is a male pelvis okay so how pelvis get formed bilaterally the two hip bones posteriorly the sacrum is there and inferiorly sacrum articulate with the coccyx so sacrococcygeal joint is there Now, this pelvis is divided again into true pelvis and false pelvis. How? The pelvic brim divides the pelvis into false pelvis and true pelvis. True pelvis contains uh, <coughs> viseras like uh, urinary bladder, rectum in females, uh, uterus and in um, false pelvis it is also treated as the abdominal cavity, the intestine and all the <coughs> organs lies in the false pelvis okay so what is the difference between male and female pelvis so there are so many differences overall we are going to see seven differences okay so first the male pelvis is taller and narrower it is taller and narrower while the female pelvis is larger and wider larger and wider then second, the bones of the male pelvis are thicker and <coughs> weighted, means thicker, thick in uh, compared with the uh, female bones as they are the thinner and light weighted, okay. These are the thicker and heavier as compared with the female <coughs> pelvic bones. Then the third, the this is the inlet, this is the inlet and this is the outlet. Okay, so inlet of male pelvis is heart shape while the outlet is narrower. The inlet of female pelvis is oval in shape and outlet is wider. So these are the three basic differences what we have seen. First, the male pelvis is taller and narrower. Second, the bones of the male pelvis are thicker and heavier while the bones of the female pelvis are thinner and light weighted and third the inlet of male pelvis is heart shape see you can see the shape this is the heart shape and the outlet is narrower okay while the inlet of female pelvis is oval in shape and outlet is quite larger as compared with the male pelvis these are the basic three differences and four differences again <coughs> with each part of the hip bone the iliac crest iliac crest of the male pelvis are higher and more prominent they looks the higher and more prominent as compared with the female pelvis then second the pubis pubic bone this is the pubic arch the both the pubic arch from the subpubic angle and it is closer to 60 degree in males since it is narrow and it is wider in females it is more than 80 degrees it is closer to 90 degrees in female that is both the pubic arch moves apart in females okay then the third ischial tuberosity ischial tuberosity of male hip bone or pelvis are in turn while the ischial tuberosities of female pelvis are everted outward okay everted and the sacrum the sacrum of male pelvis is <coughs> longer and narrow how it look like longer and narrower while the female sacrum is shorter and wider 
okay this is the coccyx it is interned it is interned and it is immovable see this is the coccyx it is interned and it is immovable while the female coccyx is straightened it is straight and flexible so so overall these are the seven differences okay see this is the male pelvis now i'm going to show you female pelvis now see this is the female pelvis so first difference the female pelvis is larger and wider see large and wide and male pelvis is longer and taller means uh, taller and narrower but it is uh, shorter and wider then second difference bones of the female pelvis are thin and light weighted as compared with the male pelvis then the third the inlet see this is the inlet which is quite oval in shape while the outlet outlet is large as compared with the male pelvis okay these are the three basic differences and now fourth differences iliac crest is less prominent as compared with the male then the pubic sub pubic angle means the angle between pubic arch it is pubic arch moves apart it is near about 90 degree close to 90 degree okay now the ischial tuberosity they are inverted outward in uh, outward direction okay and the sacrum sacrum is shorter and wider the male sacrum is longer and narrower it is short and wide and the coccyx it is not interned it is straight see you can see in straight direction straight and flexible okay so these are the seven basic differences of male and female pelvis so this is the female pelvis and this is the male pelvis okay you can come here thank you if you are having any queries about regarding this video you can put your queries in the chat box and uh, the links of previous videos are given in the description box so keep in touch subscribe the channel share it and like it thank you